What's going on? This is Adam Soul Horse Solomon, you're my student Jonathan Flores, from Ring Lodge Ball Hill in Cary, North Carolina. Just want to share you, with you guys a uh, Machado rolling guard pass you can use uh, for gi Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. You can try to do it no gi and for MMA as well, though I don't recommend it because the gi kind of provides some friction and some resistance, which is very important to make the technique work. So Jonathan is down and I'm working to pass his guard. Yeah, I'm here using my standing guard pass. Once again, like always, you can control here or you can control with the pistol grip here. I don't like the pistol grip as much because, you see, if you look at his pants, they actually have a really short cuff and I really don't get very much material. This way I feel like I get a little bit more material. If the guy has big floppy pants, pistol grip works good. Otherwise, I like to go here. Okay? And just like any other standing pass, I want to fake one way first and then I want to go the way that I want to go. Usually, I'll throw his legs to the side and start walking around, but if the guy has strong legs, he's going to keep trying to recover guard this way. So this is a good variation you can use. I'm here, boom, and I'm going to actually pin his leg to the ground here. Okay? This is going to effectively trap this leg and this leg. Okay? In order to finish the technique, I'm going to drop my body on top of this leg. Now I'm not going to roll up his body, I'm going to spin in place here, looking with this arm to finish the pass. One more time, slow. Okay. Here, boom, I pin, drop my weight, spin in place, look in, and I finish the pass. Time fast. Okay. 